guys, welcome to this one hour energized class designed to help you get more energy and relax into your body. Start in a nice and comfortable seated position. And settling in, maybe a gentle sway side to side if that feels good. If you want to lean all the way forward, back or to the side. Anything that feels good to focus on before you turn your attention inwards. Maybe gentle rotation for your neck from one side to another. Or relaxing your shoulders a little bit. And whenever you're ready, bring your attention into your inhales and exhales. Inhale, float your hands up high, bring your palms together, and your thumbs right in front of your heartbeat. Settling in. Big inhale through your nose. And long exhale out your mouth. Two more times. Big inhale. And long exhale. One more time. Big inhale. And long exhale, settling in. And gently releasing your hands, leaning all the way towards your right. Big and help to lift and open up. And easy exhale, settling in. Notice how each inhale lifts you up. And in the exhale, settling. If you want to lean a little bit backwards, it can be a nice shoulder stretch. Coming all the way through the middle, we'll twist to the opposite side here. Inhale to lengthen, then easy twist, looking backwards. Bring your back hand across the opposite knee and drop your head and neck for an easy roll here. Rounding all the way up, same on the other side, leaning towards your left. Big inhale to lift and open up. And easy, exhale, settling in. Letting your inhales gently lift. And exhale to settle here. Maybe leaning towards the back if it feels like a nice stretch. And then coming all the way through the middle, we'll twist on the opposite side here. Nice and help to lengthen. And easy, twist, looking to the back. Bring your opposite hand, your back hand across the opposite knee and drop your head and neck for an easy roll here. Gently rounding all the way up, walking your hands behind you one step at a time, leaning towards the back. You want to lift your hips up, see how that feels. And coming all the way to the middle, crawling a little bit in front of you, one step at a time. Relax your head and neck here. If you want to come all the way down to your elbows, go ahead. Rounding all the way up to sitting, we'll meet on our hands and knees. Finding a comfortable stance to roll around, maybe side to side or forward and back. This is a really good spot to kind of reset and notice how our body feels. You can try some gentle rotations around your neck from one side to the other side, going nice and slow. And facing your fingertips towards your knee here, maybe one hand at a time. And you want to try both hands, see how that feels. Maybe leaning side to side or forward and back. It's a spot that we hold a lot of tension without noticing, you know, when we're on our phones, on, on the computer, writing, drawing. We use our hands a lot more than we notice. And this helps in getting on in all those tight spots. Placing your fingertips towards the front, gentle cat cows from here, big and how round your back, tuck your chin. And easy, so drop your belly, face your chin upwards. We'll do two more of these, big and how. And easy, exhale. One more time, tuck your chin, round your back. 
and drop your belly, face your chin upwards. Tuck your toes, lift your hips up and back into a downward dog here, settling in, relaxing your head and neck, gentle bend on the elbows and knees, opening the back of your legs with a nice sway, that feels good. So make sure there's not too much tension on your wrists. If you feel like there's a lot of weight here, maybe walk a little bit closer towards the back here. Nice and easy bend in the knees. Finding a position that's comfortable for you. And on your next inhale, lift your heels all the way up to your tippy toes for one. And easy exhale, settling in. Two more times, big inhale. And easy exhale. One more time, big inhale, lift all the way up. Easy exhale, just settling in. Then we'll gently crawl all the way out into a plank pose. Nice long wave here. Side plank on your right. Lean all the way to the right. Big and help to open up. And easy exhale, coming all the way to the middle. Same on the other side here. Big and help. And easy exhale. Soften your elbows. Come all the way down to your belly. Interlacing your fingertips behind you. Maybe coming all the way up if that feels good. And an easy sway side to side. When you're ready, plant your palms outside your chest. And we'll round all the way up. Sink your hips towards the back for a child pose here. Relaxing your forehead on the mat if that feels good. Letting your inhales and exhales do all of the work. And slowly crawling all the way out into all fours here. This time, crawling towards the open side, slide your right foot towards the front of your mat and settling here for a couple of breaths. Let your inhales and exhales carry you through. Any variation that feels good, if you want to stay up here, that's good. If you want to try the bottom, that might also be fun. Maybe crawling out to the side, gentle sway side to side. Really getting into those hips. See what you need right now. And letting your inhales and exhales carry you through. And slowly lengthening your arms. We're going to lean towards the left side. Easy twist to open up. Then exhale, leaning to the opposite side here. Inhale, pulls you open. And one more time on each side here. Lean left, big twist. Easy exhale, switching sides, lean right, another opening here. And coming all the way to the middle, keeping your knee on the mat, tuck the back toes as you shift your hips for a runner stretch here. If you want to sit on your heels, if you want to come a little bit further out, just drop your torso on your thigh here. Maybe a nice sway side to side, letting your inhales and exhales roll through you. And we'll crawl all the way out into a low lunge, tuck the back toes, lean towards your left, another nice twist opening. And then coming all the way to the middle, lift your hips and ground your back heel behind you as you fold forward for a single leg forward fold. Relaxing your head and neck here, maybe gentle bend on the knees. And settling in. Sink your hips for another low lunge and crawling through the middle, high lunge, big and how to round you up. And easy exhale, coming all the way down, relax your knee on the mat, crawl towards the open side to slide that front foot to meet the back. So same thing on the other side here, sliding your left leg to the front of your mat. And settling here for a couple of deep, long breaths. Again, any variation that feels good, up, down, or to the side. Maybe a nice sway and one side will feel different than the other side and that's perfectly fine. See what your body needs right now, as of this moment, today. We're always changing, so 
don't worry. You might feel different from one day to another. That's completely normal. You're lengthening your arms. We're going to lean all the way towards our right to twist and open up. Same thing on the other side here. Lean left and pull open. One more time on your side here. Let your inhale pull you open. And the exhale switching sides and another nice opening right here. Coming all the way to the middle. Keep your knees on the mat. Tuck the back toes as you shift your hips for a runner stretch on this side. Balancing through your fingertips and bring your torso close to your thigh. Any option that feels good, you can stay folded right here. If you want to come a little bit higher up, gentle bend on the knee. See how that feels. And simply let your inhales and exhales flow through you. Calling all the way out into a low lunge, tuck the back toes, lean towards your right as you twist and open up here. All the way to the middle, lift your hips and ground your back heel behind you as you fold forward for a single leg forward fold. Relaxing your head and neck, gentle bend on both knees. Then sinking into another low lunge, high lunge here, roll all the way up. And easy exhale, settle down here, crawling to the opposite side to slide that firm leg all the way to the back. Tuck your toes, lift your hips up and back into a downward dog here, settling in, maybe a nice soy side to side, opening the back of your legs here. And we'll slowly walk to the front of our mat, one step at a time, maybe a hand and a foot slides together, nice and easy here. Once you reach the top, stay folded. And we'll slowly round all the way up to standing, no rush here. Once you reach the top, big and I'll float your hands up high. And knees exhale, rounding all the way down. Two more times here, rounding all the way up to standing. Let your back open up, notch by notch. And whenever you reach the top, big and hell. And knees exhale. One more time here, rounding all the way up to standing. Big and hop, float your head up high. Easy, exhale, folding over, interlace your fingertips behind you. Relax your head and neck for an easy shoulder release. Gentle bend on the knees. And slowly releasing your fingertips, leaning towards your right foot, slide the left leg behind. Low lunge, coming up through the middle, high lunge, and easy, settling in. Big and help to lift, and easy twist towards our right side. And we'll tip all the way to the back for a nice long reverse. And easy exhale, spin everything open towards the left, ground your back heel, face your front toes towards the front of the mat. Make sure your knee is not dropping into your thighs. Nice and open so you can open up your hips, maybe a nice way side to side as you settle in. And whenever you're ready, big I have to pull you up. And easy exhale, settling here. Two more times, big and help. And easy exhale. One more time. And help pulls you up. And exhale, settling. Nice and help tipping all the way towards the back. Nice long reverse. And exhale, tipping all the way to the front. Four on your thigh, big and help to curl your belly open. Retracing our steps here, inhale pulls you up, and easy, exhale, tipping all the way to the back. And one more time, tipping all the way to the front, forearm, nice opening, curling your belly open. Gentle bend on both knees, or lower our right fingertips towards the mat here, open triangle here. If you want to lengthen the front leg, go ahead, make sure there's no pain. Softening both knees as you switch sides here. Nice, easy twist. And one more time on the side. Open triangle. And bring your hand towards the mat. Lift your back heel. 
and ground it behind you as you fold forward for a single leg forward fold. Relaxing your head and neck here. Nice and easy. And lean a little bit towards the back as we crawl all the way to the front for warrior three on this side. Relaxing your head and neck, staying soft. And we'll round all the way up to standing here, hugging your left knee close to your thigh, close to your chest here, any version that feels good. If you wanna grab the hold of your big toe, open it up to the side. Whenever you're ready, bring your foot in to your thigh for a tree pose here. Any version of tree up high, down low, settling here. And when you're ready to settle, if you wanna bring your hands up high, Stay here for a couple of deep, long, easy breaths. Letting your inhales and exhales roll through you. Letting your breath carry you along. And when you're ready, hug your knee close to your chest, swing that foot behind, catch a hold of it with your hand, and stay here if that feels good, or you wanna sink into a dance or play around. Nice and easy. Coming all the way to the middle, we'll overlap our left leg on top of our right, and then bring our hands together. <laughs> Sinking through our hips, lifting through our fingertips, and unraveling everything up. Big inhale, and easy exhale, folding over. This time, leaning towards your right, your left foot, slide that right leg behind you, low lunge on this side, crawling through the middle, big inhale, high lunge, and easy exhale, settling in. One more time, big inhale, and easy twist towards the left side, tipping all the way to the back for a nice long reverse, and then opening everything towards the right side, grounding your back heel behind you and facing your front toes to the front of the room here, making sure your knee is not dropping and settling here for a couple of deep long breaths. Anything you want to do with your arms, if you want to swing side to side, open up your hips, go ahead. Nice and easy, finding a comfortable spot. Whenever you're ready, big exhale, pull your hand up high. Easy exhale, settling in here. Two more times, big inhale, and easy exhale. One more time, inhale pulls you up, and exhale, settling. Next inhale, tipping all the way towards the back, nice long reverse. And easy, exhale, tipping all the way to the front, forearm on your thigh, big and help to curl your belly open. One more time, inhale, pulls you up, easy, exhale, tipping all the way to the front, and tipping all the way forward, forearm on your thigh, big and help to curl your belly open. Softening both knees as you bring your left fingertips towards the mat here. Open triangle on this side, if you want to lengthen the front leg, go ahead, make sure there's no pain. And then softening both knees as we switch sides here, twisting towards the back to open up. And one more time on this side. Nice opening here. Coming all the way to the middle, lift your back heel behind you and ground it as you fold forward for a single leg forward fold. Bring your torso close to your thigh and relaxing your head and neck. And leaning a little bit towards the back as we crawl all the way to the front for warrior three on this side here. Gentle bend on both knees. And we'll round all the way up to standing, one notch at a time, no rush here. Hugging your knee close to your chest. If you want to grab a hold of your big toe and open it up. Any variation that feels good if you're ready to come into a tree, bring your foot close to your thigh. Any option that's good, down low, to the middle, up high. Settling here for a couple of deep, long breaths. If you want to bring your hands all the way up, big and up, float them up high. And easy settling, maybe a nice sway, side to side. Let your breath carry you along. Let all the trees flowing, nice and easy in the breeze. 
lot of stillness and some gentle movement. And hugging your knee close to your chest, swing your foot behind, catch a hold of it with your hand. Stay here if that feels good. If you want to sink your hips, arch your leg a little bit for a back for a nice dance or pose. See how that feels. Staying easy on the standing leg. And then we'll wrap everything on top, right leg on top of the left one. And then raveling your arms with each other, sinking through your hips, lifting through your fingertips. And unravel everything, relax your foot on the mat, big and help lift you open up. And easy exhale, folding forward, putting some weight onto your hands as you sink into an easy squat. So any option of squat that feels good to you, maybe rocking side to side, forward and back. Find a squat that's comfortable. If you wanna, you know, play around, open up your hips, go ahead. If there's no right or wrong, just see how you feel. If that's too much, you can always crawl a little bit towards the front or stay here in the back. You can crawl your hands here, relax your head and neck for a couple of deep long breaths. If you want to bring your palms together and your elbows inside your knee, that's also a good option. Or if you want to try twisting, maybe leaning to one side to open up. I'm going to go for a wrap behind you. And same thing on the other side here. Whatever your body needs, whatever feels good. If you want to try rocking forward and back for a crow pose, following your breathing, big and how to rock forward. And easy exhale, rocking all the way back. A couple more, big inhale. And easy exhale, following your breath. The goal, what is the goal here right now? Just to move your body with your breath. It isn't to bring your feet all the way up. That doesn't really matter. It's just, you know, slow body workout here, moving in harmony with yourself. Inhale to rock all the way towards the front. Maybe one day one foot comes up. Nice and easy. Maybe another day the other foot comes up. Just following your body along. Any kind of play that feels good for you. Have fun. <laughs> And when you're ready, we'll slowly crawl all the way back into your downward dog here, relaxing your head and neck, gentle bend on the elbows and knees here. Again, finding a comfortable downward dog for you. If you want to crawl closer to you, relax your head and neck, that's good. Make sure there's no pain anywhere. Down dog split on your right, leaning towards the left side, big and help float your right leg up high. Gentle bend on the knees to open up the hips. And easy exhale, step that foot right between your hands in front of you. High lunge from here. Big how to round all the way up. And easy exhale, settling. One more time, big how to lift. Easy twist towards the right. And how leaning all the way backwards. And this time we're gonna crawl all the way to the front here for warrior three. Relaxing your head and neck. We'll gently round all the way up to standing here, hugging your knee close to your chest, any version of tree that feels good. And settling here. Big and how to float your hands up high. And easy exhale. Maybe diving all the way forward in front of you here. Single leg split, relaxing your Head and neck, maybe a nice opening for your hips. Doesn't matter how you look, see how that feels. Coming all the way to warrior three, leaning towards your left fingertips, gentle twist, twist a half moon right here. And switching sides, leaning towards your right side, stacking your hips on each other, open half moon. And coming all the way back to the middle. Step your foot behind, low lunge, big and high lunge. And easy exhale, coming all the way down, leaning on your palm as you slide that front leg behind for a plank pose. Side plank on your right, big and high open up. And easy exhale, coming all the way to the middle, same on the other side, big and high. 
and easy exhale, relaxing your elbows, coming all the way down to your belly for one. We'll do this two more times. Tuck your toes, big inhale, and easy, coming all the way down. One more time, coming all the way up, and rolling all the way down here. And then tuck your toes, step your hips up and back into another downward dog. Settling here, nice sweet side to side. This time, down dog split on your left, lean right, big and help float your left leg up high. Gentle bend on the knees to open up your hips. And knees, exhale, stepping that foot right between your hands in front of you. Rolling all the way through the middle, high lunge. And knees, exhale, settling. One more time, big and hop to lift. Easy twist towards the left here. Nice long reverse, tipping backwards. And then coming all the way to the front, we're crawling into warrior three here. Relaxing your head and neck. And rounding all the way up to standing. Hugging your knee close to your chest, any version of tree that feels good. Settling here. Big inhale, hug your knee close by. And we'll dive all the way forward here for a single leg split here. Relaxing your head and neck. Gentle bend on the knees. Doesn't matter how you Look, let's see how this feels. It's a good hip opener if you want it to be one. Gentle bend. And then slowly coming up to warrior three here, leaning towards your right. We'll do a twisted half moon here. And easy, so coming all the way to the middle, leaning to the left, stacking your hips on each other, open half moon. And easy, so coming all the way back, stepping your foot behind you, nice and grounded, low lunge, coming up through the middle, big and how high lunge, and easy, so leaning towards your right palm, slide your front leg all the way to the back here, softening your elbows, coming all the way down for one, two more times here, coming all the way up, and easy, all the way down, one more time, big and hell, and easy, exhale. And then tuck your toes, lift your hips up and back for another downward dog here. Walking towards the front of your mat, one step at a time here. No rush, slide your foot, slide your head along the way. And settling here. Gently rounding all the way up to standing, big and help. And easy, exhale, folding over. Interlace your fingertips behind you, relax your head and neck. Gentle bend on the knees. And crawling a little bit in front of you, putting some weight on your hands as you sink into a squat here. Again, any version of squat that feels good. Rocking forward and back, side to side. You want to try going for a crow pose. Go ahead. Let your inhales and exhales carry you for the ride here. This is already a full body workout. See how that feels. Make sure there's no pain or you're not pushing on anything. Just listen to your body. As you go along for the ride here, nice and easy, no rush. And whenever you're ready, we'll meet on our hips. We're gonna do some boat rise from here, grabbing a hold of your shins, right here, right here, any version that feels good for you. And then we'll come all the way down for one, and easy all the way up. A couple more here, going all the way down, now rocking all the way towards the top, rolling all the way back and rocking all the way forward. Good. Going all the way down and going all the way up. Three more times here, leaning all the way back and rocking all the way up. Two more times, leaning all the way back and rocking all the way up. One more time here, leaning backwards as you rock all the way up. Doing some side rolling towards your right side. Big and how to come up in the middle and twisting to the other side and going all the way to the middle and rolling to the side and coming all the way up and rolling to the other side and coming all the way up, rolling right here, coming all the way up and rolling on the other side. How many of these we're doing? <laughs> Maybe a couple more on each side. I'll count for you, don't worry. Rolling all the way to the side. All the way up, and rolling all the way to the side, two more on each side. Rolling all the way here, and coming to the middle, and rolling to the other side, and coming all to the middle, one more time on each side, rolling all the way here, 
coming to the middle, and I'm rocking to the other side and coming all the way to the middle, grabbing a hold of your shins and your feet. See how that feels. And we'll slowly round all the way back to the mat here, settling in, maybe rocking side to side, forward and back. This time facing your feet towards the ceiling, big and how to drop it in front of you, big and how to hug it close by. A couple more of these, facing your feet up high, drop it in front of you, and inhale, hug your knees right in. Let's do four more of this. Face your feet up, drop it in front of you and hug it right in. Face your feet all the way up, drop it in front of you and hug it right in. Two more times, face your feet in front of you, drop it in front of you and hug it right in. <laughs> One more time, face your feet in front of you, drop it all the way down and hug it right in. One more time, face your feet in front of you, drop it right in and hug it right in here. Good. This time, facing your feet all the way up, Hugging your right knee close by, drop your left leg to a hug. And we'll gently switch sides. And easy switch. Any kind of switch. So any speed you want to do this, you can do this slower. You can do this faster. See how that feels. Nice and easy core work. <laughs> nice balance here. Some people like to do it faster, others like to do it slow. Just see how that feels. Stretching your legs along the way. And whenever you're ready, hugging your knee close to your chest, maybe rocking side to side, forward and back. If you want to come into a happy baby, grab a hold of your big toes and just rock side to side. See how that feels. Maybe lengthening one leg. Try lengthening the other leg. And then we'll slowly rock forward and back, taking your time here. No rush as you come all the way up to sitting. Phew! How did that feel? <laughs> Placing your palms behind you, fingertips facing your toes. Big how to lift and open up. Easy, exhale, settling in. We'll be on all fours here, taking your time, no rush. Finding a comfortable stance, rolling through anything that feels good to roll around. Nice and easy. If you want to do some stretches for your shoulder, you can thread your right hand right under the left one. Come all the way down to the mat here. And let your inhales and exhales roll through you. See how that feels. Coming all the way up to the middle, same on the other side, threading your left hand under the right one. Come down on your shoulders if that feels good. If you want to stay up, that can be another good position to be. Whatever you're doing, find something that works for you. And let your inhales and exhales roll through you. And all the way up to the middle. We'll sit on our heels. Let me show you here. Big and how to float your hands up high. Easy exhale, drop your left hand behind. You want to grab a hold of it with your opposite hand, see how that feels. If that's too much, you can grab your shirt or just leave it resting here. Big and how to lift your right elbow up high. And exhale, settling in. You want to draw a small circle right in front of you with your elbow, see how that feels. And then releasing your hands, same on the other side. Big and how to lift it. And dropping your right hand behind you. Catching a hold of it if that feels good. If that's too much, you can just let it relax. And pointing your left elbow close to your, the ceiling. See how that feels. And if you also want to draw another circle on this side. Nice and easy. And releasing everything we'll need on our hands and knees. Tuck your toes, lift your hips up and back into a downward dog. 
Relaxing your head and neck, gentle sway side to side. And walking towards the front of your mat, one step at a time here. A hand slides with your foot, settling in. Or fold, any kind of fold that feels good. You can step on your palms if that feels nice. If you want to grab a hold of your elbows and just breathe here. Any variation that's good for you. You can also relax your hands in front. This time, leaning towards your right leg. We'll slide the left leg behind. Ground your back heel as we round all the way up for warrior one here. Facing your hips towards the front of the room. Gentle bend on the back knee. Maybe a nice slight side to side. And the option that feels good right here. Your hands are up high. You want to bring your palms together. Or your hands right behind your head. Chilling here, nice and easy. Make sure your knees are pointed to the outside of your mat, not falling all the way down. Nice opening. And then when you're ready, interlace your fingertips behind you, big and hard to lift and open up. And easy exhale, folding forward. Two more times, big and hard to round all the way up. And easy fold. One more time, big inhale, and easy exhale. Big inhale to round all the way up, and exhale, folding forward. Now letting go of your hands, bring your back heel to your toes, hauling into, crawling to an open space that you feel comfortable. Relax your knee and your foot on the mat. So any variation that feels good here, staying up high, down low. Just notice how you feel. Maybe gentle sway side to side. And stay here for a couple of deep, long breaths. Let your inhales and exhales do all the hard work here. You want to explore and crawl around, go ahead, maybe back the bend knee, bend the back knee, grab a hold of your foot if that feels good. If that's too much, you can ease out of it. Make sure there's no tension anywhere. When you're ready, putting some weight on your hands as you tuck the back toes and scoot your front leg across for pigeon pose on this side. So any kind of pigeon that feels good to you. You can sit on the side. If you wanna come to the middle, see how that feels. Any pigeon that works for you. When you're ready, big and hard to open up. And if you feel like crawling all the way towards the front here. Settling here in for a couple of deep, long breaths. Big and hold through your nose. And long, exhale out your mouth. You want to relax your head on the mat, see how that feels. And just bring your attention to your inhales and exhales. Notice how in each inhale your body fills all the way up. And in the exhale, settling in. Staying here for a couple of deep, long breaths. If you want to stay here in the middle, go ahead. If you want to crawl around from one side to another and explore, see how that feels. Listen to what feels good for your body. If you want to linger in a spot that feels nice, stay there. Nice and easy and how's it exit? When you're ready to come out, slowly straightening your arms, easy twist towards your right. If you want to play around, maybe bend the back knee, catch a hold of it with your hands, see how that feels. If that's too much, just ease out of it. If you want to hook it to your 
in our elbow crease. Lean towards the front. Sometimes it can be a good stretch, but again, if it doesn't feel good, just ease out of it. And then leaning all the way towards the side, we'll slide all, we'll lean towards the right as we slide our back leg all the way to the front, maybe catching a hold of it with our hand. Nice, easy stretch here. Then bring to the side, all the way to the middle. If you want to go for a twist, bring your opposite hand to the outside of your foot and we'll twist towards the left side here. Nice and easy, gentle bend on the knee. See how that feels. And coming all the way to the middle, hugging your knee close to your chest. If that's too much, you can also grab a hold of it with your hand. Anything that feels good for you. And leaning towards the back as we slide our right leg all the way up. Place your foot outside your knee and easy twist towards the left side. Hooking your elbow and your knee with each other. Big and how to lengthen. And easy twist, looking towards the back. And counter twist on the other side. Coming all the way to the front. Crossing our legs, if you want to put your ankle on top of your knee, see how that feels. If that's too much, you can always put it in front of you. And settling in here. Big and out, float your hands up high. And easy, exhale, folding forward here. Relaxing your head and neck. Maybe a gentle sway side to side. If you want to explore, maybe crawl from one side to the other. See how that feels. If you want to go for a twist, maybe bring your elbow outside your thigh and your knee and open up. And same on the other side. If you were leaning on one side, maybe crawl to the other side here. Gentle stroll. If you want to do another easy twist, bring your elbow and your palms together. See how that feels. Coming all the way to the middle, retracing our steps. We're gonna unravel everything, meet on all fours. Tuck your toes, lift your hips up and back into a downward dog. Then walking to the front of your mat one step at a time, sliding your foot and your hand along, and staying folded here. Lean towards your left foot, slide your right leg behind for a low lunge on this side, grounding your back heel, and rounding all the way up to standing. Forward one here, and easy exhale, settling in. Make sure your hips are facing the front of the room. Gentle bend on your knees, and the knee pointing towards the right side. Nice, easy opening. Anything you want to do with your hands, you can stay up high. Bring your palms together and that feels good. Or interlace your fingertips behind you as you just chill here for a couple of deep long breaths. Moving your hips side to side if that feels good. Letting your inhales and exhales roll through you. And when you're ready, interlacing your fingertips behind you, big and hug to lift and open up. And easy, exhale, folding forward. Two more times, big and how to round all the way up. And easy, folding forward. One more time, big and how. And easy, exhale. Releasing your fingertips, crawling a little bit towards the side for a nice opening. Bring your back heel to your toes. And then once you're comfortable, relax your knee and your foot on the mat. So anything you want to do here, stay here for a couple of deep, long breaths. Big inhale through your nose. And long exhale with your mouth. Nice and easy. The side doesn't have to be the same as the other side. You want to come down low or to the side. See how that feels. Falling around. And just letting your inhales and exhales roll through you. If 
You want to try bending the back knee and grabbing a hold of your foot. Go ahead, make sure there's no pain. If that's too much, just simply ease out of it. Nice and easy. And putting some weight on your hand. Come through the middle. And we'll scooch the front leg, tuck the back toe, we'll scooch the front leg across for a pigeon on this side. So any variation of pigeon that feels good for you, settle in here. Big and hard to open up. And easy and exhale, folding forward. Staying here for a couple of deep, long breaths. Relaxing your head and neck. And letting your inhales and exhales roll through you. Bring your attention to your inhales and exhales. And notice how your body feels with the big and how filling up. And easy and exhale. When it's melting to the mat. Stay right here if that's good. If you want to explore and play around, maybe crawl a little bit towards one side. You want to crawl to the other side and linger here. See how that feels. Whenever you have enough of this one, we'll slowly lean towards the left as we slide our back leg all the way to the front. Grab a hold of our big toes here. Facing towards the front of the room, maybe gentle bend on the knees. If you want to bring it all the way out, see how that feels. If you want to go for a twist, bring your opposite hand to the outside of your foot and easy twist to the right. And coming all the way to the middle, hugging your foot close to your elbows here, grabbing a hold of it. See how that feels. If that's too much, you can always grab it with your hands. Nice and easy stretch. When you're ready, lean towards the back and slide your left leg all the way out. Place your foot outside your knee. And easy twist towards the right, anchoring your elbow to your knee. Inhale to lengthen. And easy twist, looking towards the back. Big inhale, and easy exhales. And counter twist on the other side. Come all the way to the front, crossing your legs. Again, if you want to put your ankle on top of your knee, go ahead. If that's too much, you can put it in front of you. Finding a comfortable space to be. Big and how to float your hands up high. And easy exhale, folding forward here. Maybe a gentle sway side to side. Relaxing your head and neck. Anything you want to do here, if you want to lean towards one side and stay here for a couple of breaths. Draw to the other side. And coming all the way to the middle. Lengthening your feet in front of you. Gentle bend on the knees. Big have to lift and open up. And easy exhale, folding over. Grabbing a hold of your shin if that feels good, or your feet. Any option that feels good. And rounding your back heel, bringing your torso close to your thigh. Take a big inhale to fill you all the way up. And easy exhale, settling. A couple more here. And whenever you have enough of this one, slowly coming all the way up. 
We're going to round our back towards the mat. If you want to bring your knees along for the ride, go ahead. Nice and easy here. Rocking forward and back or side to side. If you want to come into a happy baby, grab a hold of your big toes. See how that feels here. Bring your knee close to your elbows, maybe rocking side to side, or maybe lengthening one foot and opening up. When you're ready, hug your knees together. This time grabbing a hold of your right knee, relax the left leg all the way down towards the mat here. Bring your knee close to your chest. If you want to open your hips, you can drop your knee to the outside of your hips, bring it close to your elbow towards your left side. See how that feels. If you want to bring it in for a twist, drop the knee all the way towards your left side the ground if that feels good and then lengthen your hands and open up looking at the opposite side letting your inhales and exhales roll through you coming all the way to the middle switching sides hugging your left knee close to you and relaxing your Right leg all the way down to the mat here. You want to open up your chest, bring your left foot to the outside of your mat. Maybe hook it to your elbow if that feels good. If you want to bring it in for another twist, roll all the way towards your right side. Drop your knee to the floor if that feels good. And spread your arms wide open as you look towards the opposite side. And then coming all the way to the middle, hugging both knees close to your chest. Any final twists and rolls you want to do or stretches right before relaxation, you can go ahead, maybe into a bridge or a shoulder stand that feels good. You want to try your bridge, place your feet outside the mat, face, place your feet in front of you, and then lift your hips as you bring your palms together. And when you're ready, slowly coming all the way down. If you're ready to relax now, gently straighten your legs in front of you. Maybe bring your hands to the outside if you want to bring both your hands on top of your stomach. If that feels good, you can do that. And gently closing your eyes. Bring your attention into your inhales and exhales. If you want to try to do another body scan, Starting from the top of your head, just bring your attention there and slowly scanning through the rest of your body, softening if you notice any tension anywhere. Bring your attention back to your inhales and exhales. Notice how with each inhale your body lifts and opens up. And in the exhale, softening, melting into the mat.
Stay here for as long as you want. And whenever you're ready to get out of this one, start to bring more air into your body. Big inhales. And easy exhale. Maybe gently wiggling your fingers and toes. Maybe gentle rotation around your wrists and ankles. If you want to go for one final stretch, bring your arms above your head. Big, nice opening. And whenever you're ready, hug your knees close to your chest. Maybe rocking side to side. And leaning towards your right side or your left side. Rolling to whichever side you feel more comfortable in. And staying here for a couple of breaths. And with strong, lazy movements, using your head, moving from the middle to come all the way up to sitting. Nice and easy. Settling in here. Being nice way side to side to settle in. Big and half lay your hands up high, bring your palms together and your thumbs right in front of your heartbeat. Settling in. Big and half through your nose. And long exhale out your mouth. Two more times, big inhale. And long exhale. One more time, big inhale. And long exhale. Stay here for as long as you want. Feel your heart beating for you. And whenever you're ready, open your eyes. Namaste. Thanks for coming and joining along.